Oh, hello. Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Chaz, and today I'm gonna be watching a reaction. This is gonna be a reaction to Sniper Wolf. Uh, she's a huge YouTuber. All right, without further ado, here we go. We have Sniper Wolf reacting to Car Mechanic Tries to Scam Woman. Go. Hello friends, it's me. It's me. Today, and we're gonna be watching a video about a car mechanic who tries to scam a woman. Let's watch. I'm gonna have to promote one of you two now, huh? Before you continue, sir, I just gotta say, I love that suit. Absolutely perfect. Thank you, Leroy. It's not gonna be that easy. Ha, your suck up attempt was ineffective. Try harder. <laughs> Try harder. That's funny. I'm promoting the person who can earn the most amount of money for the shop by the end of the day. Who can earn the most money at the end of the day? Smart, but also kind of scummy. Yeah, they're gonna do whatever is necessary to make as much money as possible. Colin. I think she's right. Not the best idea, Colin. I get it, make the most money by the end of the day, but you're kind of encouraging people to do whatever to make the most money. I digress. Shop manager. Can you imagine? <laughs> That'd be like a dream. So to shatter your dream, but that manager position's mine. Ooh. Pretty soon I'm gonna be your boss, so you should get used to taking orders from me. You know what? Start by throwing that away. Sheesh, he didn't even get the job <laughs> yet. Bro, I thought we were homies, like we work together. And this dude like, throw him at trash. You're gonna have to get used to it. That was pretty savage of me. Sheesh, <laughs> what is that? Que pasó, Jose? Actually, uh, my name's Sam. My tire sign just came on. Can one of you check it? Yeah, not a problem, I'd be happy to. Just go ahead and... Uh, lo siento, but no. <laughs> we don't oh. fill air here, Paco. Spanish is Take it to the gas station. Bro, you stupid, Asian. Sam. Also, most mechanic places are supposed to fill air, but every time I need air in my tire, suddenly they're just like, mm, no. Air in tires? A few weeks ago, I desperately needed air in my tires, right? Oh, really? My tire flatter than a pancake. And then one guy's like, sure, I'll put air in it. And then I go to the air guy, and then he's like, no, but there's a gas station across the street. And I'm like, what? And so I, I drove to the gas station, and the air pump was broken. I literally started crying. It was such a hazard to drive oh. home. God, that was anxiety inducing. I didn't know that that actually happened. I'm baffled. Personally though, I when I need air in my tires, I just go to a gas station. Uh, I don't know, maybe that's just me. One of you please just check? No, the answer Man, is still no. Sure, I'll check it for you. Okay, just pull your car in. Thank you so much. See, I wish this happened to me. And I know filling up tires <laughs> is usually free, but whenever somebody does it for me, I tip them like 20 bucks. All right, 20 bucks for air? I'm down, bro. I mean, I ain't gonna pay that, but honestly, give me 20 bucks, I'll put air in her tires. Wasting your time with poor looking people, and maybe then you'll get ahead. Look, Ooh. I've always believed in helping people. Okay, and besides, you should never judge a book by its cover. Well, my judging so a handsome. book by its cover, that dude looked like he spent a lot of money on his car, right? Ugh. <laughs> Did you look at that? A woman who knows nothing about cars. This should be like taking candy from a baby. Honestly, whenever I pull up to the mechanic, I know they be doing this. <laughs> Does that really happen? Wow. Hey, my check engine light is on. Oh. I, I think I may just need some new spark plugs. Well, I know as a woman, you probably don't know much about cars, but take it from me. Oh. This would be very serious. As a woman, uh, you probably don't know anything about cars. I would have just done and left. She know what a spark plug is? That's a start. You know something real is about to happen when... If I could just get some spark plugs, I can change them myself. Look, look. Just because you found some inspo on Pinterest doesn't mean you know about oh. cars. Trust the experts, <laughs> sweetheart. Some inspo on Pinterest? Bro, like, I'm gonna pin some spark plugs to my mood board? Like, what What do you mean? Me and him will have a problem. Like, we will fight then and there. She just said she could put them in herself. It's Christina, by the way. My husband doesn't like it when other men call me sweetheart. Ooh. Mm, sure. This dude's certified butthole. Certified butthole. Can you say that on YouTube? Okay, yeah, that guy's definitely not spending any money. We'll see. Five to ten K because the check engine light came on. Who's gonna pay it? You gotta be stupid, stupid to fall for that. Thanks again. <laughs> this isn't even my car. Stupid, it's my daughter's. Stupid. I have a business to buy. Sure you do, Hector, and I'm the CEO of Tesla. <laughs> That's kind of funny, bro. Darn man, script writers got a raise, I see. Here's the thing, Sniper Wolf, I need you to know this. This was the first script we really got to do some jokes. You know, the script was good, the script was funny. Maybe I was funny. Who knows? There. This dude was complaining so much for something that takes like 10 seconds. And y'all ain't even busy. Here at Chris's Car Repairs, we believe in always treating customers like family. Except this guy. This guy will treat you like garbage. God bless you. <laughs> I won't forget this. And trust me. It's true. Luckily for you, I'm right here. 
<laughs> now, if you just give me the key, I'll give it a full inspection. But that's really not necessary. <laughs> Trust the professionals, okay, sweetheart? Girl, you got the option of taking it across the street. These shops, Diamond doesn't. I would've been like, hey, yo, this guy, let me get this guy. It's like going to the doctor for a bruise. And they're like, oh, no, 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 no. Bruise? The blood test came back. You have anxiety, depression, diabetes, and arthritis. That was a pretty good metaphor. I'll give that an eight and a half out of 10. That was pretty good. Okay, how do you know she's not going to catch you? She's a woman for crying out loud. <laughs> She doesn't know the brakes from the gas pedal. Take it from me. I wouldn't be so quick to get into a fight, woman. Gone. If the girl knows where a spark plug is, then you really shouldn't be doing this. But I'm telling you, this is very realistic because a lot of mechanics are like this. Some of them will even put a nail in your tire and be like, Oh, by the way, you have a nail in your tire. At the tire place, so you are forced to buy another tire from them. Like, some of these dudes savage. I never thought of that. She's really making me not trust anybody. The guy who gives out free air made zero dollars today. Give me a break, dude. You made zero dollars too. <laughs> My charm. I'll have to. Same point. I was actually about to just say that. More. Yeah, this dude was so charming. She had to mention that she has a husband. Whoa. <laughs> Huge favor. Five grand. And you charged me the $250 inspection fee. I said that wasn't even necessary. But the car needs a brand new engine. You should be thanking me. There's leaking engine oil everywhere. Sweetheart, you should have took your keys and left. I mean, if you're going to stay after being treated like this, that's on you. Oh, <laughs> dang. She kind of right, though. I would have left. The car was leaking. Gets on the ground and this was not for my car. Would you mind giving me some new spark plugs? What in the Scooby-Doo was that? <laughs> that was awesome. I like how this dude had to take off his shirt. I'd be like, oh man, such hard work doing an inspection. All this money I'm about to finesse making me real sweaty. Thank you, Sniper Wolf. That was, that was, that was exactly, that was my choice and that was exactly what I was going for. I'm, I'm, that's actually cool. Restart the car. No more check engine light! No check engine light. <laughs> My dude real quiet, like, I ain't got nothing to say. Christina! What are you doing here? I just came to get some new spark plugs, Dad. No. Uh, <laughs> big yikes! That was her father! Ugh. No matter how many compliments you gonna give this man, I'm pretty sure he's getting <laughs> Daddy Colin shows up, you're in trouble. Hey, I'll call it Chris. <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay, so, well, I'm so glad I was able to fix your car for you. Uh, I'm so glad, I'm actually so embarrassed that I'm actually gonna leave and never come here again. Uh, don't worry. <laughs> Juan, what are you doing here? Hey, Sam. I told you I'd be back, and this time, I brought my car. I'm oh, thinking about so being at Red, getting some new rims, maybe even a new sound system. What do you think something like that would cost? Um, I don't know. Off the top of my head, around 10 grand. That sounds great to me. Let's do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, awesome. Just wait for me in the lunch and I'll be right with you. Great. Thank you. Wow, no appointment or nothing? Business that slow? Like a dude can just bring his car and be like, I want this, this, this. I call up a show and be like, yeah, it's gonna be like a three month wait. Now, are you serious? No, no, you can't talk anymore. I'm not anymore. gonna work for him. You Unless lost you make me talking privilege. Uh, I'm gonna quit. Uh, nah, he gonna keep talking. Necessary because you're fired. Oh. <laughs> See, at this shop, we like to treat everybody like their family. Okay, maybe he lies, cheats, and scams his family. This is unbelievable. <laughs> Can this day get any worse? It's possible. Hey. Leroy might do that. Can I give you some advice? Oh, I thought he was going to ask him if he could give him a hug. <laughs> <laughs> Knowing Carlos, he probably, he probably would ask me for a hug. <laughs> Take it from the nice guy. You got me fired. Thanks a lot, sweetheart. Uh, sorry, you got yourself fired. <laughs> Did you just call her? Oh, I thought they got the rock Sweet up in here. Why? Who are you? Her husband. Oh. Oh, that's a big dude. <laughs> oh, man, that was good. I feel like that production quality up. I felt like I was watching a movie. Okay. What did we learn? Uh, we learned that Sniper Wolf needs to get a new mechanic. Seriously, I don't know where you're getting all these problems, but I got a guy if you need it. Hit me up. I got you. All right, guys, so that's going to be all. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this reaction to the reaction. You seem to like it. If you like this one, please go ahead and smash that like button in the face. And you want to see more content like this, guys, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss anything. All right, guys, if no one else has told you today, I love you. Peace.